Shane, welcome. Thanks for being on the show. Yes, thank you. I'm privileged to be here, so um, I'm excited. Oh, you're sweet. Thank you. Well, hey, I've been seeing you on my TV screen a lot lately. <laughs> so on Celebrity Treasure Island. Yes. So for yes. people who don't know, who aren't in the grip of it, yeah. what's the show about? They call it Celebrity Treasure Island. Is that I call you? It, I, I, say, <laughs> I call it personalities or, or however you want to look at it. Celebrities, yeah, it's a hard one for me to say that. But yeah, personalities that people know around New Zealand. Yeah, yeah. they all come together on an island. It's the last time they... they they put together a Treasure Island show like that was uh, 12 years ago. So, oh, right. um, so, and I remember watching it when I was younger. And I was still coming through as a boxer and very busy with boxing. I was always captured, cap captured watching the show every time. I was, I was thinking I'd love to give that show a go. And cool. then it just didn't happen for well 12 years. It was yeah. And then I got a phone call from my agent and he said uh, they're they're casting people for Celebrity Treasure Island. Would you be interested? Yeah. He, I don't think he had, had even finished the sentence. I said, yes, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in. He goes, Jesus, I've said it to some people. And they're like, oh, no, I don't think I can handle that because, you know, you're living it rough and they don't know the conditions and there's no food and stuff like that. But I'm like, oh, no, no, it's not yeah. good. that's okay. I'm keen, I'm in, I'm in. So was it really like that, though? Is there literally no food and you've got to compete for your food? <clears throat> literally, yeah, you've got to compete for your food. So oh. uh, each day, because it was initially for the first, um, we started with 16 people. Yeah, and once 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 it got down to eight people, then they all combined and we all lived in one one camp. But other other than that, it was one blue team, which we were the blue, blue team, which was Marco, and then there was another team, yellow team, which was Kahu. So um, we we competed against each other each day. Uh, and one of the challenges during the day each day was uh, the food challenge. So whatever the food w was um, and whatever the challenge was, we had to win the challenge to get the get the treats. You oh know? wow! So and it's treats. A survival of the yeah, fittest. Yeah, 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 exactly. <laughs> yeah, and we weren't the fittest at the start, you know. Like, um, and it wasn't like I'm I'm physically strong and all that sort of stuff, but. When it comes to this upstairs with the old puzzles, oh no, oh no, you don't want to take me to the trenches if there's anything to do with puzzles, you'll die. <laughs> but if it's fighting or lifting something, yeah, yeah have me yeah. on your team. Well, being a boxer must have given you a head start in, in a lot of it. Uh, it did, it did, and, and it didn't, it didn't, it didn't, it, it sort of exposed me when I first got there in the first challenge. I was well out of my depth, you yeah. know, and you had to go there and you had to work out the clue and then try and find the next clue and try and find someone else and then find someone that was buried in the sand. I was like, oh my God, my confidence just went from there to down to here because yeah. I was like, oh no, this is not what I expect. I thought this was going to be more like, uh, you know, more physical, but yeah. you got to understand where, 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 where there was all different types of people. You know, there were sports people, there's personalities, there's actors, and some are strong, some are not so strong, and some are not so fit. And then, so, so they had to mix it up and change it up and... There was a lot of luck in that game. Yeah. There was a lot of luck, you know. And, and I suppose you look at it like there's strong people in the team, you know, and as the game went on, the, you want the strong people out because if you get to the end, you get to the final, then uh, you're up against someone very strong. So you want to get to the final and be, and be up to, against someone that's not as strong as you. Yeah, so yeah. It's, it's a game that uh, I didn't play it that well, but I, I made it to the final, and that was that was really cool, you know. So uh, you must have done quite well. <laughs> yeah, you know, I did well to make it to the final. There was a bit of luck involved, not just for me, but for everyone, you know. So, but there was people that played the game very well, you know. Um, so, how long did it last? How long were you stuck on this island for? Yeah, uh, uh, three weeks. Yeah, three weeks. Yeah. So, if you let, so, made it right to the end, it was three weeks. Yeah. Yeah, three weeks. So um, yeah, it was hard the first nine days because the first nine days we didn't win any food. Actually, we won, we won one challenge. You didn't win any food no, in the first nine days. No, first nine days we didn't win any food, and but we did win a challenge. And guess what the challenge was? I have no well, sorry, idea. guess what the um, the prize was? Not one food. bottle of champagne. <laughs> 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 one bottle of champagne. And we're like. <laughs> Oh, my well, we're God. having champagne later, so uh, <laughs> stick around. Yeah, yeah, but I'm sure these food ladies do. <laughs> we don't have to win the challenge. Hey, maybe, yeah. But, and, uh, and did you guys fight? Like, was there a bit of rivalry? Oh, I don't like this oh, 100%, person. Yes, oh, 100%, yes, 100%. There was rivalry, yes, there was rivalry. Only because, like, our, our team were very civilised. We had Barbara Kendall as, our, as yeah. our team captain, and she was really cool. She set the president straight away in terms of... You know, because you win each day, uh, you win clues, as in, uh, so you can choose to keep the clues yourself or share them with your team. We chose to share them with the team, so at the end of the day, only one person will win. Yeah. You know, so if we share the clues, then everyone um, gets a chance. So yeah. if I had three clues and then I share it with everyone else, just in case I don't make it to the final, then they know, you know, so we were yeah. very good in that way. Whereas the other team, Team uh, Kahu, they kept all their cl clues 
individually. You yeah, know, they were really to their chest, yeah, yeah, yeah. They didn't, they didn't, you know, they weren't thinking laterally, laterally like um like how we were. Yeah. And we just had a good time. You know, yeah. we just had a good time, and uh, yeah, no, it was it was it was awesome. Would you do it again? I would. Yeah, yeah I, would, I would do it again. I don't know if they'd pick me again though because it's uh, <laughs> well, we've done it. You know, we've yeah. done it. You know, and and. Uh, how would you say your personality was in it? Well, you know, your persona on the TV screen. Yeah, yeah, well, that was just me. That's just me. me. <laughs> yeah, and I suppose, um, like, as I spoke to you earlier before we come on here, was people don't know me, uh, my personality, or they don't know me as everyday Shane Cameron. They normally know me as the fighter who, you know, talks tough and, and, and hurts right. people, knocks people out, and, and, uh, and that way, you know, so yeah. they haven't really seen. Yeah. And you've hardly hurt anyone today. Sorry? You know, you've hardly hurt anyone today. <laughs> <laughs> hey, wait till we crack that wine up and later. <laughs> I'm going to be ringing one yeah. wine. No, no, Actually, no. you've been here before, though, haven't you? Yes, you've I have. recorded in the studio. Your daughter's recorded. My daughter, yeah, yeah, twice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah um, Georgia, yeah, she's um, it's really cool, really cool to spend time with Jesse, and uh, my daughter loved it, absolutely loved it. Yeah. And so you're a father, you're a Commonwealth boxer. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, so I started boxing late. Um, I'm a, I was a farm boy before that. I was a, I was a shepherd. Oh, yeah. I, used to, I used to ride a horse. To, uh, I ride a horse to work, and then um, you know you take different pathways in life. And I went to the UK for my OE when I was uh, 19. Yeah. And I was watching some boxing on TV, and I was saying, oh, I want to give that sport a go. And then yeah, within a year and a half, I was ranked number three in England. And three more years later, I won a bronze medal at the Commonwealth, Commonwealth Games. And, then 10 years after that, I won a, yeah, I fought for a world title and then, yeah, made some money out of the sport and, and done well. But, uh, yeah, and then now I'm still in the game. I promote, promote fight nights that are on Sky TV and I have my own boxing range out called Counterpunch. And, yeah, yeah, keeping busy. I own a gym on the North Shore. So, yeah, yeah. Certainly, certainly plenty enough to do. And in between that, go to Fiji and get starved. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You look good. I mean, you look really Thank skinny. <laughs> Yeah, well, that's not a compliment when you say that to a guy. If you say that to a woman, oh, they love you, they love you. If you say that to a guy, oh, it's like, no, I'm, not, I'm not skinny, I'm just probably a bit lean. It was a compliment. <laughs> I'm like, oh, your bum Thank looks you. good in that, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, hey, it sounds to me, in hearing what you said, you had an idea that you wanted to be a boxer, you became a boxer and yeah. nailed it. Yeah. You went, oh, I'd like to be on Celebrity Treasure Island. Yeah. Travis like, boom, done it. Um, What's next? What's next? I just keep challenging myself. I've got a lot of goals that I want to do with my counterpunch business, which is a, it's got a lot of opportunity. Basically, yeah. anything to do with boxing. And my vision in, 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 is basically in boxing. When they think boxing, they think Shane Cameron. We do. Because I promote, I promote boxing. I manage a lot of fighters. I promote fight nights on Sky TV. I own my own boxing brand and range. Uh, I, I run counterpunch uh, courses around the country where I can. I'm the only person that. That's an accredited person that can accredit uh, uh, personal trainers around the country as a, as a personal trainer to give them a level one certification. Um, yeah, and a few more other things, but I'm not going to go on about them. <laughs> it's not about me, the show is about you. <laughs> now let's talk about me. No. <laughs> well, thank you so much for joining us. That's when cool. I think boxing, I think Shane Cameron. Uh, thank you very Thanks much. Thanks for being here. Thank you.